Hello, Quit Apple here on my free to play Gaelic account. Um, today is a strange day. This is at the end of the Herndig event. Um, it's the first day of the boosted summons. Now, see, I've had offers on these at 10 bucks a shot, but once I passed level 50, they started hitting the $25 mark. I just hit level 50. Um, so if you're going to buy, if you're not going to be free to play 100%, but, you know, you buy occasionally, that $10 pack or $15 pack is a good deal. So that commercial over, I don't know where that came from, but um, you have this crazy one right here, Guaranteed Champion. This guy's good. I'm not saying he's not. Guaranteed pull. Um, on my main account, I have 15 shards. I'm going to debate a little bit, but I'm actually saving up my Sacred Shards for the 10 times event for Dracomorph. I'm still trying to get a Dracomorph. It, you know, maybe get me to a two key on my um, my unkillable, my budget unkillable. But at the same time, this guy's crazy cool. I I wouldn't go for it. If you're free to play, I wouldn't go for it personally. Uh, but if you got the money. He's an interesting champion. This would be my second Banner Lords uh, one on that account, my main account. But anywho, back to this account. Um, you have these targeted boosts, and on this account, I don't have any of these. In fact, this account doesn't ha has not opened up a shard. This is officially the first shard opening of this account. So with that being said, let's get in there. Now, I have to, just to let you know, um, that was the wrong click. I have to open up enough shards minimum to get to right here, 3,000. But I might go 3,500 since I'm really close. So we'll open up enough shards to get it done. And I still got to get some void uh, potions. I won't be fusing him in this video. Uh, I am going to get it, but I think I'm going to get one extra champion and I'm going to go for uh, Heferus for the abilities that he offers in Skinwalkers. That's, but anyway, that's a whole other side story too. Again, all right, down to the facts. I gotta open up shards. Um, so I've gotta make 3,500 points. Right here is approximately 3,000. But I don't know if I wanna open up all my void shards. But I, you know what, hey, let's get her done. Let's start off with the void shards. Let go, let go. All right, here we go. So we're gonna summon up uh, well, hell, let's just go for all 11 of them. I'm going to say the Ancient Shards for a two times event. So we'll see. on That'll be another day. I'll, I'll open up those on that. So 38, 39 days, 61 shards free to play. It is possible to get some shards. Here we go. If this account gets a Legendary and 11 shards, I'm going to freaking be crazy. Now, we do need on this account, we do need Maneater, Painkeeper, um, there's some other really good ones you could use. And these are all brand new. On this account, these are all brand new. So, Steadfast Marshall, not a bad champion at all. You can always look at the reviews if you want to look real quick. Okay, he's terrible. Terrible. Hmm. But, you know, these are going to help my faction wars. All these champions will help my faction wars. I won't be fusing any of these or getting rid of any of them. One epic would be nice, minimum for this account, because this account is still free to play and hasn't gotten any new champions. Ah, Curzon Depart. Perispex. Fear Grinder. Oh, I thought he was good. No, nope. Faction Wars. There you go. Great for Faction Wars. And possibly good for Faction Wars. Man, one epic, please. There's a Doom Screech. That's crazy, you don't get him. And. Let's see, so this is 10 right here. I wonder if the Mercy Rule. No, Mercy Rule doesn't kick until 20, I think for these shards. Last one. Dun, 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 dun. 
Alright, all rares. Boo. Okay, but we opened them up. We warmed up the machine. Just a quick shot over here. We can look to see on the summon rush. Um, we ended up with 1320. So if I open up three shards, I'll be at 1820. So then I'm going to have to open up enough shards. I might not go for that legendary skill tome, but we'll see what happens. All right, so we're going to open up these. Here we go. Three of them. Well, if I want 1320, that's 18, 18 of these. I'll just open up these 10 at a time, the first 10, I'll open 10 at a time. Let's just see what it looks like. Oh, boo. Hold on a second. All right, I just bought the 10. Spent 2 million. Increase the ranks. All right, here we go. Here's those 10 we were talking about. Ooh, epic right off the bat. Nice. At least we get one epic. Yay! Adriel. Not bad, not bad. Uh, remember, these are all brand new. First epic. First epic for the game. All right, now i got to do math, so hold on a second. Um, I need 1,500. Oh, I passed it. Okay, cool. All right, so now we're going to open up the... Legendary shards. Is that what you've been waiting for? Six minutes into the video. Boo, six minutes into the video. Here we go. One. Guaranteed epics. Two. Ah, uh, Cage Breaker. He was like the one of the first ones I got in my main account two years ago. And three. Still not a guaranteed one, though. It'd be nice to get into the guaranteed section. Oh, hey, Oax to remember. There you go. A 10 times event. You got one in the, in the event. Awesome. So that means, ladies and gentlemen, um, in the summon rush, I got another assassin. And I got this gentleman. So now I can, uh, I have to wait a, a day or so for my... I don't collect those unless I need them, and you've got two days, three days, plus one or two days to collect later on, so just in case I get busy this weekend or something, and I can't get into it, so, ah, uh, red dots, they just get me, these little red dots, that get me every single time, so, alright, I have enough to fuse um, this guy, I just gotta rank him up, and you can see that these guys are all ready, uh, and now I have enough champions, uh, I just gotta get them up. Uh, I'm going to get a Heferes, Heforis. I don't have the Void Shards for that champion. So as you can see, these other guys will be no problem. Uh, I, didn't ha I did get the Assassin on this one that I needed, so then I got my fourth Assassin. And um, let's see, one extra there, one extra one there. But I, did be able, I was able to skip a, a, a couple events and, and take a breather to get out of that. So, all right, I'm going to uh, work... I gotta I gotta wait a day or so for my um, my dungeon to open up, which is uh, this is this probably tomorrow for me. That's probably tomorrow for me. So in the afternoon. So all right. Well, thanks for watching. And hey, this account I will make a, a another video later on. But this account, what it was doing was I only had one champion at level sixty, and I wanted to see what I got today. And with what I got today, I have uh, these two champions, plus I'll have, so one, two, three, four champions, plus I also have um, another champion, uh, Hephoris. I'll have Hephoris in this mix. And Hephoris will be a good uh, reviver for me. Um, uh, here's a good heal champion, but uh, Hephoris will be a good revive champion. For me, and I need a good revive champion. But this will give me all three of my colors. I'll choose uh, one from red, spirit, and magic to level to to rank up to 660, and then the, then I'll get my first four champions at 660. So that's what this has all been about, holding off for this first event. 
So this does kind of show you that it is possible. And the only reason I did was because I had over 2,000 gems to start with. And I probably spent about 1,500 gems for energy and other little things uh, to get this done. So I hope this video was helpful. And I'll make one more video where I summon him and I show you what I did just to show you that I could summon him. So, all right, guys, have a good one. Talk to you later. Bye.